This is really important, guys, really important. Never go up and grab your biceps. Don't do that. Watch what I do. When I go up, you can just lightly, just put your right hand on my wrist. So I'm going up. I'm crawling and I'm getting up here. Once I get up here, whether chin is down or not, it doesn't matter. Watch what I do. I never pull this out and grab my biceps. When you do that, his two hands that are on this arm, let's say he has two hands. When you grab your biceps, he's gonna get a space and he's gonna hide and you're done. That's the reason you can't finish your chokes. Watch, when I climb up and now he puts two hands, when I do this, I put the hand behind the head first, my elbow covers my hand, then my fingers pop up. You guys see that? My elbow covers my hand, my fingers pop up. I never do it like this and then this, okay? I don't do it that way. Now, what if you're gonna lock your hands? The same thing, I go here, I place my hand in good position, Go ahead and try to get a little gap. When I lock, there's no gap. He has no gap. It's still pressed against his chin. Okay, and now I can squeeze. And he'll either tap, or he, what can he do? He can pop his chin up, and then now it'll be a choke. Okay, and that's fine. So also, so you guys understand, sometimes people will say, I, uh, I don't want to do a neck crank. I don't want to do a face lock. Guys, listen. This is a neck crank, okay? This is a neck crank. This is a face lock. This is not a neck crank, okay? I don't care if your partner says his chin is down and he goes, you crank my neck. You can pop your chin up. That's your choice. You can pop your chin up anytime. Putting your chin down is not a defense for the rear naked choke.